Roswell Flight Test Crew here at the International Drone Expo, and I'm talking to Trey Player, who's representing the X Eagle Quadcopter. How are you doing, That's Trey? Right. I'm doing great, thank you. Good, good. Now, I walked by, and this is an intriguing little quadcopter. On the surface, it looks like a lot of quadcopters these days, but why don't you tell me what sets this one apart? Uh, what sets this apart from the other ones is that this is the only drone that's operated via smartwatch and voice commands. Voice commands? How does that work? So what you do is you essentially press a button right here and say, Fly Pro, take off. And the drone lifts up to the desired altitude, sits there and hovers until you give it its next command. Wow, and then it, on top of that, it's also got a follow me capability. Absolutely, a follow me and a circle capability. So you tell the drone, Fly Pro, follow me. You take off on your skateboard, your motorcycle, whatever, the drone keeps up. Cool, uh, so let's take a closer look at that watch. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so this is the smart watch for the X-Eagle. And this has all of the perimeters that you need right here. It allows you to take off. This one right here allows you to circle. This button right here is the button that you push to tell the drone to land. This is the home point button, and this is the altitude dial. You push it up for the drone to go up in altitude, and down for the drone to decrease in altitude. And this dial right here adjusts the position of the drone. So why don't you give me just the, the specs, everyone wants to know, how long does it fly for, that kind of stuff. Right. Well, the drone comes with a 5500 milliamp three cell battery. So this is the smart battery that comes with the X-Eagle. Power it on, the lights indicate how much charge is left in the battery. You got a full charge right here, so we're good to go. We're averaging between uh, 20 and 22 minutes of flight time. Okay, okay. And um, I... The watch is really cool, Yeah. but um, what, if you're an old school guy like me, you want to be able to control the thing. Is that an option? Absolutely, yeah. You have the option of getting the drone with just the watch, or you can add the controller as well. Okay, cool. The next generation is going to have ultrasonic collision avoidance. Yeah, that's right. We're incorporating sensors into the ends of all the arms and onto the lower part of the drone as well. So that way, whenever it is in the follow me mode, if it comes up to a tree, a wall, something like that, we, we don't want to crash a drone. We no. want it to stop. Thanks, Trey. Appreciate yeah, it. Thank you for having me on. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Okay. And from IDE, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off.